On March 21, 2025, the world of military aviation did a double take when former President Donald Trump, flanked by Defense Secretary Pete Hegseth and Air Force Chief General David Alvin, revealed Boeing as the winner of the Next Generation Air Dominance Program. This wasn't just another military briefing, it was a cinematic unveiling in the Oval Office itself. Trump boasted that the F-47, already flying in secret for five years, was leagues ahead of anything on Earth. Other jets are good, he claimed, but this one. This is level sticks. Cue dramatic music. Stealth mode activated. The F-47 isn't just another aircraft hiding behind radar cloaks, it's the James Bond of the sky. Boasting cutting-edge stealth technology, it's built to be virtually undetectable. And when we say stealth, we're talking radar cross-section levels so low that even the F-22 starts looking like a Christmas tree on enemy radar in comparison. Its smooth, futuristic airframe avoids common radar traps found in other jets, especially at wing joints. The F-47 even echoes Boeing's 1990s Bird of Prey experimental jet, rumored to have a radar signature that could practically sneak past a motion sensor in a museum, a design that's part jet, part origami. One glance at the F-47's concept art tells you this isn't your average fighter. Its aggressive chin line from nose to tail and canard-like structures scream futuristic ninja. These design elements not only boost maneuverability, but also help the jet maintain a freakishly low radar signature. Unlike many traditional jets, the F-47 flaunts a diamond-shaped cross-section sleek, smooth, and all angles like it was designed by someone who's really into origami and war. It even avoids the wing fuselage radar traps that plague Chinese jets like the J-20 and J-36. This careful shaping is more than aesthetic. Every angle, edge, and surface is calculated to bounce radar away like a sci-fi deflector shield. Even the possibility of canards with a high dehedral angle hints at boosted agility without compromising stealth. Its stealth geometry turned into art and then weaponized. Smaller, faster, smarter. Forget the days of supersized fighter jets that move like freight trains with wings. The F-47 flips the script. With its slim body and likely single-engine setup, it's smaller than the F-22 and possibly even the F-35. That compact frame does not just look cool, it makes the F-47 more agile and easier to maintain. A single nose wheel, rather than a bulkier twin setup, also suggests it's light on its feet, or rather landing gear. This isn't a sky whale, it's a sky cheetah. Smaller size also means easier deployment from more locations, including shorter runways or even mobile bases. That agility pays off in both dogfights and logistics, letting it outmaneuver threats while staying under the radar literally. It's a fighter jet built for the age of mobility and smart warfare, not brute force. It's a team player with a drone army. If the F-47 had a motto, it'd be why go solo when you can fly with backup? This fighter is designed to operate alongside a pack of five or more autonomous drones. These wingmen will act as missile carriers, decoys, and scout units, letting the F-47 focus on agility and stealth instead of becoming a flying ammo dump. It's the air combat version of leading a robotic superhero squad. Think Iron Man, but with drones instead of Jarvis. These drones aren't just extras, they are equipped with sensors, targeting systems, and AI decision-making. That means they can flank enemies, soak up radar attention, and even deliver precise strikes independently. With this dynamic setup, the F-47 becomes the quarterback of an unstoppable aerial offense. Super speed, no super fuel bills. The F-47 isn't just fast, it's Mach 2 plus fast. But what's the point of being a blur in the sky if you run out of gas halfway through? Boeing may have cracked that code too. Thanks to advanced metal printing construction and clever internal layout, the F-47 could hold more fuel without bulking up. Combine that with new adaptive cycle engines boasting 25% to 50% better fuel efficiency, and you've got a fighter jet that can go further, faster, and longer than its fifth-gen cousins. The Air Force might just save enough on gas to afford another one. This combo of high speed and high range is a logistical dream less need for mid-air refueling means more time on target. It's not just efficient, it's tactically brilliant. Imagine a fighter that can hit hard vanish 
and be back in time for lunch, with fuel to spare. Techie yet budget-friendly. Here's a plot twist no one saw coming. The F-47 is cheaper than the F-22. In military budgeting, cheaper doesn't mean it's on sale at Walmart, it means you might actually be able to afford a few hundred instead of a few dozen. And since the production model is expected to be more streamlined, the cost per unit will continue to drop over time. More jets in the sky, fewer zeros on the invoice, that's a win-win for air dominance and accountants alike. This affordability also allows the Air Force to build a larger fleet without blowing up the defense budget. It opens the door for more experimental squadrons, rapid replacements, and even export options in the future. In short, it's not just a cost-cutting move, it's a strategy for sustainable superiority. Built for the fast lane. According to General Alvin, the F-47 is already mature, which in jet speak means it's more than just a pretty 3D model. Multiple test flights have taken place behind closed hangar doors over the last five years. A prototype is scheduled to fly by 2028, with mass production kicking off in the early 2030s. That's record-breaking speed in the fighter world especially compared to the F-35, which spent more time in development than some college degrees. The F-47's development pace reflects lessons learned from past delays and overruns, streamlining both design and approval processes. It's like Boeing skipped the awkward teenage years and went straight to combat-ready adult. With this momentum, the F-47 could hit operational status before its competitors even leave the runway. A fighter jet with upgradable DNA. What makes the F-47 truly revolutionary isn't just its stealth, speed, or sidekick drones, it's its flexible future. Unlike previous jets designed to serve for 40 years or more, the F-47 is being built with rapid replacement and upgrade cycles in mind. In other words, it's designed to evolve. This keeps it on the cutting edge without turning into a flying antique halfway through its service life. It's like getting a new iPhone every few years except it flies, fights, and costs millions of dollars. The modular architecture allows easier swapping of avionics, sensors, and even propulsion systems. It's the kind of future proofing that means less downtime, more dominance. And in the ever-changing arena of air warfare, adaptability is the ultimate weapon. Boeing's comeback tour. For decades, Boeing played backup to Lockheed Martin in the elite fighter jet league, but the F-47 marks a dramatic return to the spotlight. It's the first time Boeing has built a completely new fighter jet from scratch, not an upgrade, not a reboot, but a full-blown innovation storm. They have invested heavily in new facilities, new technologies, and fresh engineering talent to make it happen. This isn't just a contract win, it's Boeing planting a flag in the future of aerial warfare, and saying, yeah, we'd still got it. With this jet, Boeing isn't just building aircraft, they're rewriting the rules of engagement. The F-47 proves that bold design and smart strategy still win contracts and maybe future wars. After years of playing it safe, Boeing's finally breaking the sound barrier of innovation. If you found this look at the F-47 as thrilling as a Mach 2 flyby, don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe for more deep dives into the future of military tech and aviation breakthroughs. Got thoughts on the F-47 or think Lockheed might strike back? Drop a comment, we're all ears. Until next time, stay stealthy and stay curious.